Hey folks, welcome to Boost Up Session again. Please subscribe if you haven't to support us. Today I'll be showing you how to install an account. I mean the great an account in Linux. It works for any type of Linux distro. So let us begin. Open up your web browser and type an account. Now just open the first link anaconda.com. Click on download in the upper right corner. Click on Linux and now just install the latest version and click on download. As I have already downloaded it, so don't have to download it again. Here it is. Just right click on this file, go to the properties, go to the permissions and click on allow executing file as a program and close it. Now press Ctrl Alt T from your keyboard to launch the terminal. Click on always on top, just drag and drop this file and press enter. Now press enter to go to the license agreement. Now just keep pressing enter and here you see it's asking for the yes or no option. So just type yes and press enter. Now let it be the default location, just press enter. It won't take very long. Now here you saying to initialize an account of 3 so just type yes and press enter now your an account is ready okay so now what you got to do is just type source space dot bash rc and press enter now you can run your an account from here so just type an account navigator hyphen navigator and press enter and here you can see that we have this an account navigator just minimize the terminal and click on ok and don't show now here you can see that we have these three one of them installed notebook jupyter lab and the spider and you can install these four if you really want them okay so let me just launch this notebook from here and this notebook will be launched in your default browser so just open it and here you can see in the default browser we have this notebook okay and just create a new folder and here we have untitled folder just select it and here you can see the click on rename and now you can rename it by thumb and click on rename okay so now we have this folder python just click on new python 3 notebook okay and here you can see let me show you by running one command print in the parentheses hey and just press shift plus enter and you can see the output okay so this way you can run Jupyter notebook close it leave now just click on log out from here and you have been successfully logged out close this now close this from here and check the notebook and click on quit and click on yes okay and now one more thing is left that is how to get out of this base so to do that just type source space deactivate okay and press enter now you are back in the normal terminal okay so now if we want to launch the anaconda navigator again and press enter it is saying that command not found so for that i have just made a wonderful script for you right here just right click on the script go to the properties it will be given in the description so just download it and click on allow executing as a program close it and now just drag and drop this file into the terminal and press enter and here you can see we that we have just relaunched the anaconda navigator okay so this way you can run the anaconda navigator again without using this base okay just close it and click on yes okay <clears throat> now here you can see that when i'm launching the terminal again it is showing me this base again here okay so to get rid of this 
Just drag and drop these two commands, okay? And this is only once. In the next time, you need to just type this command only. But this time, we have to just fix this permanently and press enter. Now, it won't just get the base in front of your username again when you launch the terminal let me show you close it and here you see okay so this was the hack you need to remember okay please subscribe to support us that's it thank you for watching now it's time to discover more simply click on the screen to subscribe to our channel and watch another video to discover more